Okay, so I wanna show you how simple it is to get into your OneDrop account and to download a zip file to unzip it and a watermark your brand on the images. So in here, you are gonna see different items that will be bundled. The reason why we had our contributors bundle the items is so that it's an easy one-click download. You have the full storyline and you're not searching around our library for slide six or slide seven. It's all together and it's a really simple download. That being said is all of these graphics are put into a zip folder. So you need to be able to unzip them on your phone. So I'm going to go into my current account because I've actually already downloaded some of these folders or some of these zip files. So I'm just going to use this as an example. So if you are going to be downloading additional items or utilizing something more than one time, you want to come into your downloads and download it again. The purpose is, is that every time you click on download, it actually gives that contributor credit from us financially to say thank you from you as our subscriber and for us to be able to compensate them. So in here, if you're on your iPhone, you want to make sure you have the app unzip. You can pop into the app store if you haven't downloaded it. It's a free download, but it'll automatically ask you if you want to open it in unzip. So I'm going to tap on that. And in here, you can see that I've already added it into my unzip folder. So see how it's in there a secondary time. So you're just going to tap on that and it's going to open up the folder that's in the zip file. You'll tap on that and it will open up all the images in here. So you'll tap on the images. They're a little bit skewed, um, but they download properly. So you're just going to click on this upload and you're going to save the image to your phone. And you're going to go through and you're going to do this for all the images. I'm just going to do it for a couple of them just so you guys can see. Save this image on my phone. Okay, so then I'm going to take these images. Now that they are in my, uh, my images on my phone, you can go into Canva or WordSwag to put your watermark on something. I personally prefer WordSwag. I feel like it's super simple, super easy. So we're going to pop into WordSwag. You're going to go into your library. You're going to go into your folder. And I'm just going to grab this first one right here. So you can see at the bottom, it gives you options to crop things. So this is an Instagram story. So I want to make sure that I'm staying with that Instagram story. And in here, you'll see that it gives you a text. Um, you're going to double tap on that text. You're going to take that away and you're going to put in your brand and you're going to spell it right. <laughs> One drop. Okay, so you can do a couple of things in this app called Word Swag. So you can change out the actual font however you want it. So you can also go in and change the color. So I'm going to keep it black. And then I'm going to change the style back to ultra clean just because I like a really clean, easy brand. And then you can just pinch it or stretch it depending on where you want it. So the purpose for watermarking your items is just to make sure that you are keeping that item as your own branded item. This also protects your OneDrop subscription that you are paying for and allows people hopefully to understand that they too can come over to OneDrop, grab their own images and watermark it their own brand if they want to, but it just protects your investment. So in here, you're going to put your brand on there. You're going to click on save. And the cool part about this app specifically, WordSwag, is if you just click on back and you go back one more time and back one more time, you can actually go back into your library and you can pick out another one. So it's automatically going to be formatted. See how that one drop is still right there? So you can basically batch all of your items that you're wanting to watermark with this app. So just instead of closing it out, so I'm going to save this one. So you're going to click on close. Instead of clicking on new up in the right hand corner, you're just going to tap on that back button and that will allow you to go back, continue to watermark, not have to type it in multiple times. 
and that's how you can download and unzip your files in our on your iPhone with your OneDrop subscription. So hopefully this was helpful and feel free to pop back in if you need any other tutorials.